Okay, guys, I'm back from that thing. Yeah, you no! Going to strike three. Grounded foul. Oof. Left, so do it again. I kind of want to go play NBA or something different, but I really like this game. I mean, I actually don't want to give a job, but I do want to give it up to the bitch. Strike three, you're out. Oh, maybe not. Oh, well, it is now. The first win is Morales, and the inning is over. So very nice work there by Santana. His guys lead it to Jeff. So it is still the third headed coming. Well, I'm mad that they already scored two, but I'm kind of less caring more because I left for that certain amount of time. And this is on the ground for Lowry. So I really don't care. Right at this moment, it's like a zero-zero game for me right now. I really don't give a crap. If I lose, I lose. I don't care now. This game is so obvious. I'm, I'm gonna lose. I might come back with a home run, but that'll probably only be a one run home run, not uh, like a solo home run. It won't be a double, a two run home run, or a three or a grand slam. I would love it. No one has a grand slam yet. I'm kind of upset about that, but not gonna, I haven't gotten everybody on, bat, uh, on base yet. I've gotten it once, and the ball was. Uh, no, that was in my exhibition game, dang it. Oh, do you guys want to see more of my Mets baseball or not? No. Do you want to see some Mets? Or no, recommend a team that you want me to play as. Or recommend um, me a name, what I should work for. And that was nice. And what team I should be on for uh, MLB? Well, for this, but the uh, my player thing. Dang it! It's gonna be a. So where he's cold and you can swing it there. So hopefully they're set up for some kind of a breakthrough against this guy. Here we go. And this one will oh. be out of play off to the left. Just thinking they're all over here. And now pitch on the way. Nope, not a fastball, dang it. Tried to work it back to that low inside corner, but it misses one and two. Maybe a double? Maybe a double by Gonzalez? Nope. He's not running. And this is something they have not been doing a whole lot of during this losing streak, and that's getting the leadoff man on base. They, I think we've only done it like three times now. Maybe. That's our fourth. Now here's the first pitch. And this is hit well towards the hole. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Throw comes back in quickly, so they're at first and second now with nobody out. Back-to-back -back hits here have them in position to get on the scoreboard for the first time in this game. They do have five hits in the ball game now, but their key hit is eluding them so far. Kevin Euclid will dig in. He singled his first time around. In the air to right center. Hunter moves to his right and puts this all like, nah, I'm not going, going, going yet. <laughs> nah, not just yet. Vladimir Guerrero will try it again. Check down on strikes his first time. <laughs> First offering on the way. A swing no. pops him up. On I don't want to lose my chance already. No problem there for I mean, Ibar as this becomes out number two. Freaking Big uh, Poppy and Kinzales are doing their job. Freaking everybody else that has it. Swing and a miss. 
Come on, baby. Go, go, keep going. Oh, come on, I had fucking two guys on fucking base, and then I fucking can't get any hits. That was fucking three times in a row, that's bullshit. Oh, God. This is why I don't like our team. Because if I don't get a home run with those two people, or the three people that usually hit home runs, I'm going to lose. I really actually want to get rid of a couple people. Because Euclid is hitting terrible. I don't want him. He's hitting a little bit better, but not very good. Um, I want to get rid of him. I want to get rid of a uh, couple pitchers. I want to get rid of Scudero and Lowry. I want to get rid of Jason Veracek. I want to get rid of uh, Saltimacchia. I want to get rid of um, Ellsbury or Mike Cameron. One of those two. Or both. I hate to get rid of Ellsbury, but fucking he can't do shit for me. And he looks like a much different pitcher here than he did in the first inning. Fastball that's taken the other way toward left center and fairly deep. And Crawford's there to make the catch. Actually, I might have to delete all my videos that I've made. That whole time of this might just come to a whole waste. Because I'm thinking of just ending this and making a whole new uh, franchise and seeing who could be the team leader again. Now the ball swung on and taken the opposite way out toward fairly deep left center. In there, the base hit. The relay, but he'll be in there with a double. Evan Longoria got his fifth home yeah, run in the season. Not a whole lot of offense going for either team these past few innings. Let's see if the leadoff double can get something started. Leadoff double. Go three. Yes. Who's that? Salty? Thank you, Salty. Dustin Pedroia will step in, a ground out victim his last time. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 1. Oh, he looks like he's toying with him here. It's 0 and 2. They just keep moving higher and higher up the ladder. He keeps offering, why not? And this is top foul, but perhaps playable behind first. Come on, get into the stands. Get into the stands. Mm. Oh, well, I scored a run. At least I scored a freaking run. One, one run, at least. At least it's not a shutout. Home half of the fifth coming up. It's the Angels, two, And the Red Sox, one. Vernon Wells is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one. The 0-1 is a fastball low, and that evens the count at one and one. I really want to get back to the road to the show and like do someone else like do it uh player gone never mind forget the fucking run god damn it Now a third 
ball. He was banged into center field and no reach on a base hit. Not a bad guy to have hitting in your eight spot. And this guy will really slouch up there. Comes through the soft center. Jeff Mathis at the plate now. He's quickly behind 0 and 1. And this is on the ground for Lowry and could be two. Okay, we need a two-run home run, or at least two home runs in a row. Two home runs, I don't know, just something. All I'm hoping for. Like right here, here's a home run, hopefully. Maybe a two-run home run by freaking uh, Favre Ortiz. What? Back and all, as you can see, that's going to be an out. Oh, you, if you can hit a home run, I will keep you. Just got a piece of it as it fouled back. I thought it was going to be an out. Now you can see the pitching coach heading for the mound, and this is nothing more than just trying to reassure your guy and give him a chance to compose himself. He's been great so far, so there's no reason to think that he can't work out of it. Bases are loaded for who? And there's ball four now, so the bases are loaded here on the intentional walk, and of course it's a oh, oh no! Bases are loaded. Oh, base. Oh, if I could just get a fly out, like way out in the center or something. Now a ball line hard toward right yes. center, and he'll have himself a base hit. Run it in. Sick. Hit number ten. You've got to imagine he's approaching the end of the line here. Now Mike Stokes is up out of the means of dugout on his way to the mound. And it appears that change is on its way as that'll do it for Ruben Santana. Gone after five and a third here. He never really found his groove in this one. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. And this is 
on the ground is short. Could be two. Kendra on the Morales. At least it's four to three. Three runs on four hits, no errors, and a man left gone. Top of the order, you are seventh. The Red Sox lead it four to three. Elsner is there, and these fans won't like that. Is it the one pitch out to begin the home half of the six? Howie Kendrick will step in now, over two of his points. And he gets ahead here with the fastball, strike one. Outside for a ball, one and one. Foul back. One, two Ooh. is an off sea pitch. No dice, it's two and two. Three runs, four hits, and no errors to this point to the Angels. And this one's hit on the ground, but foul. Line hard, but foul. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Well, he was pretty, pretty good after that first pitch out. And now he's going to throw six pitches to the next guy. And he's just going to make him throw as many pitches as he can as he fouls another one away, and it's still full at three and two. And Jesus Christ. Well down the left field line, but back into the crowd foul. So three, two, one more time. Grounded foul. Hate to see this end as a ball. Line hard into left. But it'll be now. Right there, put it away without much problem for the second out. No! Henry Morales will stand in here, but before he does, let's take it back to the very first inning. This was a two run home run right out of the gate that really got these guys off to a fast start. And that misses ball one. And this is a guy that can run into one every now and then, so he can't be taken lightly, especially in only a one run game. And it runs outside, so it goes to 2 0 now. Fouled straight back. A 2 1 offering. And it looked like a tough fastball there as it hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. And Ellsbury will make the catch, and with that, the side is retired. Ellsbury, Dustin, Adrian, here we go. Big order right here. Top of the order. Before we get along any further here tonight, time for a look at the National League scoreboard now, again presented by the National Baseball Hall of Fame. Well, you guys can read it. I'm not reading it for you. Scores from around baseball, National Baseball Association. I think it says at the very bottom. I can't really read that at all. <laughs> I'm just assuming that's what it is. And then it says MLB 11 the show at the very bottom. <laughs> But trivia. On the first pitch of the inning is lined in the left nice double. single. Around first, digging for two now. He'll get it into second, but it won't be in time, and it's a leadoff double. Well, he might have been thinking he was still throwing his warm-up pitches because that first pitch of the inning was right down Broadway and got turned around for two bases. Now we're looking to throw back to second. And he'll dive back in safely. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground is short. Ivar throws to first to take care of him for the first down. Adrian Gonzalez to step in with a big opportunity to get that insurance run home from second. Now a curveball, and he pulls this one high and deep to right center field. A leap, but this is out of reach and off the wall. Sweet. Well, you'll see it again. Thought this one was going to have home run distance, but it bangs off the wall out there, forcing him to settle for a double.
David Ortiz will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Now the 3 0 offering. And there is Ball Ford, now so is they obviously course. want to go after someone other than Ortiz. Oh, gosh. Kevin Euclid to get another shot now. Two for three in the game. Now a swing as he shoots this down the right field line. And then he's over. And for extra bases, and then he'll get two and possibly all three of them. Michael Kahn come on and hits you with one run in the top of the seventh. First pitch and sends this one on the ground to Kendrick at second. Throw so on to Morales at first, and there are two gone now. Yeah, that's a good job by a power hitter here, realizing that the infield back, all he had to do was put it in play. And he's able to drive in the run. Carl Crawford will step in, and we'll see if they decide to pitch to him this time around. Now Crawford swings and pulls this one on the ground to second. On the first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. Corey Hunter will dig in, 0 for 2 thus far. Here's a fastball called for strike one. Yeah, it looks like they're going to try to milk one more inning out of him on the mound. Here's one hit towards the hole. And across the diamond goes Euclidus, and that's out number one. So one away now for the Angels in the seventh. And here comes the Braves. And some action now in the Boston bullpen as the right-handers up and throwing. Way late on the fastball for strike one. And for the most part, he has really gone after these hitters tonight. One and one. And he's not going to swing at borderline pitches. He knows what his assignment is. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. Had it two away from 70 pitches in the ballgame. And he Oof. takes very close to the inside corner here. Two and two, though. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. You can afford to be careful here with a four run lead, but you really don't want to be watching people at this stage. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number Home two. run, boy. In front here is this is pulled down the third base line. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. Swing hot shot yes. to the left side. But there, the spirit is Eucalyptus in the inning is over. Angels go down 1, 2, 3. Deficit Salty four. Jed Lowry and, and then Jacoby Ellsbury. Or sure, Jed Lowry and then top of the Maybe order. Better. 2 for 3 with a double thus far. Swing and a liner toward the gap in left center. And he is going to reach it's a base hit. Now this gets all the way to the wall. Not in time. And he's in there with a double. Sweet. And yet another good at bat for him right there. That's his third hit of the game. He's and not he's cold now. With a leadoff double. Jed Lowry to try again. Hopefully three yes, I hope he's not. Thus far. He just blows the fastball by him to strike one. And with a leadoff hitter aboard at second after the double, he's at least got to be thinking right side if he doesn't put one down. He's put the fastball here as he forges his head 0-2. No one out with a runner at second. Come set, now the pitch. Fastball swung on, missed for the first time. Top of the order. Swing hard liner to left center. Base hit. Around third and being waved on home. He'll come home with it. And Salty. he will score at the plate as the tag from Mathis was just a hair too late. And he's just been wearing him out so far. That's his third hit of the game, and this one's good enough to drive home that runner from second. Just does manage to get a piece there if this is bounced foul. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. In time to first, and there are two away. Well, this is a ball that I can sharpen and That's a smart play to take the chair out. Adrian Gonzalez 
will step in. He doubled and later scored his last time. Now started to go down after it, and he couldn't hold back. It's strike one. And he pulls the fastball that time high in the air toward fairly deep right center. Brayu is going to have room out there as he oh, well. pushes away to retire. Seven to four. I gotta take him out. The eighth. I gotta get. This pitcher coming on, and it's gonna be the right hander Dan Weaver that takes over. Just off the outside, it's one zero. And this bottom third of the lineup really needs to get something going here in the eighth. And it's a called strike to even the count at one. Here's a guy that understands. It's all about getting on base at this point. So. Good idea there just to wait for strike one. Too quick that time as that ball is rounded foul. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Well, if he's got the confidence to throw it two and two, let's see if he throws it three and two. There we go. My sort of still will step in, one for two in the ball game. And there's a fastball from Wheeler as he gets ahead here, nothing in one. And now looking around this place, I think these fans have just about given up hope in this one. Uh, this will get foul for strike two. And this pitch is swung on and skied out to Ellsbury in center field. I kind of want them to score one more so I can bring in Papabon to get him a save or something. Well... This is a situation where a home run here isn't going to tie the game. And he's got to work on just getting down on the ball and hopefully trying to get on base. Instead, it's just an easy fly ball in a game where they're running out of outs. And Vlad won't catch up at the base hit. Well, they pulled the string of the changeup that time, but he would have no part of it if he just waits and nets himself a base hit. And that swung on and fouled straight back. From the belt, kicks and deals. And this is swung on and hit on the ground at Pedroia at second. Throw will go to Adrian at first, and with it, the side is retired. It is now the so ninth. No runs on a hit, no errors in a man left. Jordan Walden come on now to start the ninth inning as he looks to keep this deficit right where it is to the bottom of the ninth. David Ortiz. And then he can't connect here. 0 oh, 1. <laughs> I think he's loose. Now a pitch swung on and missed as the count goes to 0 oh, 2 to work here. Kevin Euclid to see if he can keep it going. Three for four thus far. And a feeble swing that time with going one. Ah, there's that A1 slider right there. A half swing here on the pitch inside, but it's a full swing in the eyes of the home plate umpire. Strike two. Just did get a piece of that one, so he stays alive here. One out, nobody on. And a tough pitch on two strikes as he's able to foul it off. Bad ball at the letters, and he turns on it, hits it high and deep out to center field. And the Brady will get this one into the glove for out number two. That's right, it's only two. Vladimir Guerrero will step in. One for four in the ballgame. Now a swing and a ground ball for the second baseman, Kendrick. Throw on to Morales will be in time, and with it, the inning is over. So no runs, no hits, no errors, and no one Jonathan left. Jonathan Pelton-Bowen! So now to the bottom of the ninth. The Red Sox eight and the Angels three. Swinging on the first pitch as this is hit out to Pedroia at second. Go on to first and Papabon steps down the first. So this is part two, the first part. Henry Morales 
Actually, I don't even think he made the first part. Bum, bum, bum. And they obviously want to work him away as that's three straight on the outside part of the plate. And this means low here, so the count swells to three and one. And now you wonder if he'll get the same pitch three and one that he did on two and oh. And he's taking here and looks at strike two right down the middle. And sometimes you just got to wake this guy out of there. He hasn't felt right about any of those first five pitches, but number six could be different. Now here's a swing and another chance out there at second. And the throw to first mm -hmm. retires Morales for out number two. Corey right. Hunter is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. These guys would like to at least get someone on base here yes. on the bottom of the ninth. Got to make him sweat a little. The um, main he pitch. He swings through that one. So the Angels are down to their final strike oh. now. And he just manages to stay alive here as he fights this one foul. Yeah. And Corey able to lay off that one. It's one and two. The last pitch, maybe? Yeah. Yes! Yeah. I win! Winning streak! Winning streak! About time! Thank you, the big streak at the eighth, I think it was. Highlights and then see you later, guys. The big bat for the Red Sox tonight. Well, it belongs to this man, Jared Salty. Take a snapshot of that. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, man, a three hit ball game for him, but a couple of those were key hits. He scored the double very well in this one. That came within the end of the game, right here. It's a home run right off the bat. How they got to move, but yay! Salty. Two hard yards. And you keep. And you double with your bench dribble. <laughs> Now, guys, don't say, um, where's the hundred bucks you promised us? Because, obviously, you know I don't have a hundred bucks. I'm young still. I am still young. But, 
I will tell you that there will be a bonus video on Wednesday. Just look up from this video, bonus video, and it will pop up on the search thing. You'll, you might have to go down. <gasps> a seven, a seven, whatever. Woohoo! Oh god, I have to face Dan Heron. Dan Heron. Irving Santana and freaking Jared Weaver. All, all the best three on our team. And then a no name of Scott Casimir. I know him, but he's not really that good. Then we got Beckett. Pettit. Pettit is back on. And then a blank. Come on, go to the Red Sox. I think this would be Lester, right? It's Andy. A Seves. A Seves. A Seves. That's a Seves. A Seves. Or, uh, whatever. On the 28th, it is a Seves. So guys, thanks for watching. See you later. And, um, more videos coming soon. But I will be giving you a bonus video on Wednesday next week. Technically this week, because it is Sunday, but, oh well. Next week, pretty much, I'll say. It'll be up around 7. Maybe 6. I don't know when. Mm. See you later, guys.